everybody and welcome back to another episode of Battle Arena! So, there has been plenty of updates in the modding community! It's pretty much every day, new dinosaurs are added or new something is added. So, hold on to your butts. <laughs> Before we actually start, you'll notice that there are three dinosaurs already released into the paddock. Um, we have the Critonosaurus. I, I deliberately released three. So I released the Critosaurus, and I think that's the Ankylosaur. Oh no, the Chunkingosaurus. Okay. Is that its own thing now? I don't know. Either way, it, well, you got that there. These amazing uh, trees added to the game. I, I, like I said, I can't remember because there's so many mods now. It's so hard to keep track of who is making what, but these look stunning. Not only can you drag and drop dinosaurs into the game, um, you can also drop scenery into the game. So I don't think I've put... Uh, I don't think I've put, 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 put uh, everything in the game that can be. But if you scroll down, you've got the regular, you know, you get to the rocks. And then, rock 8, rock 9, rock 10. And then you've got these other ones, which have used pictures of existing ones, to add all of these extra uh, things to it. You can get, like, a cave system. Uh, all this jazz, which looks amazing. I don't know if um, if the dinosaurs kind of walk through the rocks. They probably could. Um, and to probably stop that, you'd, you'd put fences inside the rocks to stop them from being able to run through. So if I was just to grab a fence here, um, there's certain parts that I can put through, like here. So if you don't want a dinosaur to go through this bit, what you could do... I see, Oh, yeah, there's a thing there. You could put, like, a little fence, sort of... Like, running around that way. So, I mean, yeah, you can see technically there's a fence there. But they would not be able to go through that now. Um, so there's a lot of little tricks, uh, uh, tricks and things you can do. So we also have <laughs> this little patch of long grass. Which YouTube's gonna love me. Look at that bit rate. <laughs> <laughs> so if you want it, you could have a whole paddock. As of the tall grass. And also we got big trees. So big, uh, we have problems with it vanishing. Uh, I think it's basically just a scaled up redwood tree. I could be wrong but it looks like it is. So now you could have more or different types of redwoods, I suppose. But yeah, they got sticks, twigs, all this jazz, or these different plants here as well. You've also got trees that look like they've fallen over that you can add. And of course, don't even know what these things are. Well, there they are. Look at them. They're like little figs. Uh, they're, you know what they are? They're like the plants from um, the Lost World. Uh oh, oh no. That's what those are. Oh, I hate him! Oh no! So the reason, like I said, why we have three dinosaurs already in the park is because um, I don't have enough incubators for the amount of dinosaurs we got. We got like 121 dinosaurs now. It is redonkulous. Um, so we're gonna go through these. Now these dinosaurs won't attack each other straight away, so we'll get to see the new the new dinosaurs that have been added. Um, but there is definitely one that I'm wanting to check out. So give me a second, and I'll just release all these. <laughs> and here is the one we've been waiting for. A friggin' Megalodon. Oh my god. Look at that beauty. Look at that scope. That looks so cool. Now, by the looks of it, it looks like it's based on... On like a... On a sauropod? So I don't know if it's going to get any battles. It's probably the same as um, uh, the Nigerosaurus there. Although, I'm really not sure. It looks like it's probably Diplodocus by the looks of it. The way it's just so slow. I was hoping that it would be able to uh, to get some kills or something. But by the looks of it, probably not. If that's what it is exact, not exactly based on. Um, oh, hello. Oh, you little Struzy Mimes. How are you doing? Mind. Little feathers. So, let's have a look. How many dinosaurs do we have in the park at the moment? We have 118, so I have missed, I think, about three, because I know already that we, I've got a few of these as replacements for other dinosaurs, so otherwise we'd end up with two of things. So if we take a look around, what can we see? The Austroraptor is a new one, um, so it's just like a thinner version of the Raptor. Ooh, okay, okay. Now keep your eyes out for a Ceratopsian with a giant horn. Oh, Giga? That's a different Giga. I don't know what it was before. Um, I think it was supposed to be the Jurassic Park or Dino Crisis one. But this one, uh, even though it's a different skin uh, color, is the... It's, oh, it's, it's got... It's a different... It's a new Giga that just came out. Also, the first ever flyer 
we have in the game a Hatsogopteryx. Um, obviously can't fly. And <laughs> oh wow, look at look at the, look at those moves. Oh <laughs> damn. <laughs> so I don't know what this is based on, but it looks like it's a carnivore, so it's probably gonna be able to fight. So I can't wait to see that. Garfield as the usual. A toast there. Oh, we got so many kind of using the archway. But <laughs> Now, there should be a new hybrid here, too. Oh, 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 we got the Microceratus. Oh, what a cutie. It's got the colorings from the uh, original Jurassic World website. Shame that it had to just go in the, go into the freaking water when we wanted to take a look at it there. Where's the Ceratops with the giant horn? There you are. You're the Gigantoceratops. Um, so I'm hoping this guy does well. I do not know what kind of attack it has, but look, look at that horn. Oh, he's a horny boy. <laughs> uh, there is a new hybrid that is like a mixture between a herbivore and a carnivore. And it's like a Kentro something. However, I can't really seem to see it. There it is. What was it called? The Keratosaurus. Oh, already he's, uh, he's hungry. Bless him. Uh, so he needs to go and try and find some food while he can. So before things start dying of hunger and all this jazz, how about we start the battle and see if we can spot any other new ones? Because there are a lot. There's a Uteranus also in here. Go! And they're off! Who will be the first casualty? Mm. Anything in the long grass? Ooh, no. Oh, yeah, here's a new, another new one. The Australovonator. Yes, you. You're brightly colored and cute. Oh, it's the, it's the oh, compi versus, it's a tiny cup. It's a compi versus the new thing. What is that? The microcephalosaurus. Oh my God. I, I've never seen this before. This is absolutely fantastic. I need to get a close up of this. I didn't even know that these guys could fight, but apparently they can. Oh, the compi lost. And off goes the, oh, oh. <laughs> off goes the victor. Who's probably going to be chewed up by something else. But we already have five things. Dedastruthiamimus and Oranosaurus. Um, the Musasaurus killed by a Velociraptor there. We've got the pa Pachycephalosaurus killed by a Giga. We've just now had the... I think there's that a new one. That was the Isaberisaurus Isab killed there by the Spinosaurus hybrid. We've got the Sukumimus versus the Baryonyx. An Oviraptor. I was killed the uh, Guanodon. Oh, that's a shame. A Guanodon can actually put a fight up against some things. But I guess the Overaptor must be using the, um, what's it called? The Raptor. Uh, oh, Zuchikotosaurus killed by the Ichovenator or Ichthyovenator. Oh my God, there's so many, there's so many skulls. Oh, it's a shame to see the baby T-Rex dead. Majungasaurus taking on. Oh no, is that the Diplocalus? No, we barely got to see it. <laughs> An actual pancake. No, we didn't get to see him. Bless. Okay, what are this? What have we got? We got oh Gigantospinosaurus glitching out again. Oh for God's sake. Right, somebody said data. Get that out of there. It always it always messes up. We got a dead curry the source, I think, killed by Hatsogoptrix. Oh! Hatsogoptrix killed by the um oh my god, the King Kong T-Rex. No! I was hoping to see a bit more of that. Um, Triceratops killed by Indominus Rex there. We've got the Gojirosaurus killed the Microceratus. <gasps> oh no, he was the one running in the water not too long ago. Zalmoxy's dead. Suskitosaurus dead. Oh no, the new Ostoraptor killed by a Monolophosaurus, who's barely taken any damage there. The, uh, the new hybrid running away, panicking. It's already on 60% health. It's probably going to die. I thought that the hybrid would do very well. It's apparently not doing very well at all. Hyungosaurus taking on Deinonychus. Or Deinonychus. And it looks like he's probably going to win. Although, he's on 100. Unless he's fighting something else. Oh, I don't even know. Uh, what we got? Oh, with the helicopters in. The woolly rhino killed by Chilantiosaura. Oh, I love that. Ooh, that's nice looks like a toffee ice cream or something oh okay so oh, i want to see how the other thing's doing we got that big spinosaur hybrid killing that little ceratopsid we got over after killed by concavenator beautiful we had 118 now we got 71 we've lost over 100 dinosaurs the sinsato 
killed there. Sorapel the dead. Looks like the Ostrovenator. Oh, we might have a victory for the herbivores here. Hold on. I want to just see this one because he's already taken damage. And this, um, what are you, Pentaceratops? You're not Pentaceratops, are you? Oh, they're calling it off. Because he won, I think. Yep, he's running away scared. Wow, Bieber has already forgotten that those dinosaurs can actually fight each other. Hey. Chasmosaurus, that's the one. Uh, we got Indoraptor. Oh no, it's the Allosaur kill the Ichthyovenator. Wow, dead already. Oh god, I got a phone call here. Hold on two seconds. <laughs> Hello? And the Spinosaurus is dead. Oh, what a shame. <laughs> Toast! Toast is poisoned? Oh, it's one of these buggers again. It's got poison. Which one is it? Oh, Dinosuchus is alive from the aisle. And it's taking on a level 17. Oh, 100% versus 79%. Actually has a chance. Would you believe? Oh, I, oh no, we got T-Rex and Albertus. Oh, the Spino gets a first hit and so maybe not. T-Rex taking on. Oh, what are you? Albertus or? Ooh, it looks like it could be a close one. Yeah, they're calling that one off. Oh, did Megalodon kill? You're looking for water. You're looking for... Okay. Oh, we've actually got a fight with the new hybrid. There it is. Monolophosaurus, who I think is probably going to win by the looks of it. Because if I remember right, that Kendrasaur hybrid um, was low in health. It was hungry. Oh, yep. That looks like it. That looks like it's done for. Oh, it might have stood a chance. It might have stood a chance if it actually had full health because that thing has a ton of genetic modifications but the monolophosaurus wins is it gonna keep on winning oh the nucosaurus is uh is running around with its head hung low uh we oh casmosaur take it on the giga is he gonna make it a two oh I'm did he kill him oh no he didn't killed by trude who is uh he's got his jaw going there his jaw's flapping Oh, no, I kind of wanted the Casmosaur to win. He would have won that fight, but he didn't even get a kill with the other thing. And we've got the Coralosaurus. Is that it? Is that the one that has a poisonous bite? It might be. It's on 100%. Bloody hell. Uh, we've got so much death. Centrosaurus dead. Troodon still alive. Overraptor dead, even. Uh, Overraptor killed by a Concavenator, I assume. Oh, Monolophosaurus just scratching some meat from it there. Dinosaur poisoned. Is it that one that has the poison? It is that one that has the poison. Oh, no. It's not looking too good. Scudosaurus and Indoraptor is still alive. Um, oh, there you go. The poison didn't even get hurt. Oh, God, that thing is kind of crazy. Um, Balerosaurus and the Balerus. It killed. It made a kill. The cutie little ducky. No, I don't want to click on that. I want to stop clicking on that. I want to click on the cutie. How's he doing? He's, look, he's starving. He's hungry, thirsty, drowning now, apparently. We got the Nucosaurus killed by Dinosuchus. Oh, sorry, Dinonychus, my bad. Ostraptor still rotting away on the floor there. Oh, Spinosaurus takes on the Albertosaurus. So what happened to the T-Rex? Um, died with a fight to Cal. Okay, that's one of the Allosaurs. Drenort is surviving there. Mosasaur still surviving. Um, we have, oh, that would have been a good one to see. The Tarovasaurus Tanari, or whatever it is, killed by the Stegosaurus, who's now in hiding in the, the tall grass, apparently. Uh, we got to fight Monolophosaurus against Trodon, but I think Trodon is venomous, but he didn't even get a bite in. Wow, this Monolophosaurus is crazy, just killing everything. Ooh, what, what, what's the dinosaur looking at now? We're on 44 left. Got to fight against the T Rex taking on. The scorpion! Oh, he killed him! The sea scorpion killed T-Rex! <laughs> Whatever is the Pterygotus. Oh, yes, you did it! Whatever you do, how many kills do you have? You have one kill. You did it. You do it for Diplocalus. Right, what else we got going on here? We still got a Mosasaur alive. Um, a Nodosaur is killed by Spix. Um, we've got the Chill... The chill Chilitiosaurus? We got some big boys here. We've also got the, uh, I think that's Taurosaur taking on the Allosaur, but Taurosaur didn't even stand a chance there. The giant uh, Ceratopsian there, still alive. Don't know if it's made any kills yet. We got the, uh, I don't know what's going on here. The Indominus Rex is trying to line up the, the mammoth or something. Yeah, this is deadly corner over here in the desert. Not looking good. Oh, 
Brutus, the Bru Bru was a Batoroceratops taking on Indominus Rex, and it's dead. Yeah, it doesn't stand a chance. It was already down a little bit on the health, and it's probably going to die. So if we rem if I remember right, this thing actually survived. So as long as Indominus Rex dies, all of the big herbivores uh, survive, including Garfield. Can Garfield survive? Oh, it actually took a hit. Indominus Rex took a hit from the Pendaceratops thing. Wow. Impressive. Spineraptor died to Indominus Rex. Oh, wow. It, like, Spineraptor is one of those dinosaurs that has good attack. 190 attack, but 60 defense, eh, maybe not too great. The giant horned face fighting back against that crazy Sukumimus hybrid. Oh, we got a dead uh, Stegosaur in the background there. I would be very surprised with this thing, if, if this thing survives. Uh, one hit, 60 odd percent. One hit, 40 odd percent. 40 is like kind of a killing blow. Ooh, I think that's probably it. Yep. Oh, that's a shame. No, you could have done so well. You had to t pick a fight with one of the craziest hybrids, didn't you? <laughs> I mean, look at it. He's got a killer beak. Oh, poor little stegosaur. Plates for dust. Dinosuchus died to the Spix. Ooh, there you go. Sukumimus doing its best impression of the, uh, look at its, uh, bird backbone shaped like a bird or something like that <laughs> from Jurassic Park. Vestatosaurus killed by Chi. Chi killed by Isru. Oh, we got a whole food chain going on here. Um, we've got the Saurophagonix killed by, what was that killed by? The Saw? Oh yeah, the Sauriniops who apparently didn't take any damage and is going to be in one of the top ones. Um, you've got the ISR, just resting there, getting back to its 100%. You've got these giant herbivores hoping that Indominus Rex dies, and I can't see Indominus Rex. Still got to run a Titan there. We got a poisoned! Oh no, it looks like it's dying, the Mosasaur dying there. And there's Indominus Rex. Now, how many dinosaurs are left over here? Oh, a fair few, a fair few. Spinosaurus killed by Cal! Cal, oh my god, Cal is just not taking any damage at all here and is killing what's left of the carnivores over here also got a, a poison indoraptor oh my god cal is killing everything what can they do oh we got a concavenator with 51 percent against indoraptor with 39 percent who is also poisoned oh concavenator won bless i'm kind of glad because if indoraptor killed concavenator it wouldn't oh beautiful concavenator still has the chance of taking on um that thing that thing is oh it's deadly it's deadly there's a reason why it's got like the bandy bandy uh, look to it oh look at megalodon there <laughs> Hello. <laughs> it's kind of cute in a way uh, oh the fight between the giant the fish eater hybrid things i think they're both hybrids Oh, 22% for the... What's it called? I, I don't even know what this is called. Dracodenatitan? Dracodenatitan or something like that. Who knows? Giga's still doing well. Still surviving. Um, and there it is. We have the uh, the end of the battle there. What we got over here? Oh, <gasps> Monolophosaurus versus the... Oh! Oh, I thought it killed it there. What do you call the Excavaraptor? Oh, is it going to kill it? Oh, he killed it! Impressive! That Monolophosaurus did so well for so long. Now, take it out. What a shame. But, can this thing take on... What's it called? The thing over there. I can't remember what it was called. The concave in it, because I think they can probably find each other. Um, yeah. Oh, we've got the Dynanicus there, too. Um, what have we got over Giga taking on the uh, Sor Saurian Ops. And Giga not looking too hot here. Is on 47%. Probably still numbers to take it on. Oh, maybe not. 18% has still not landed a blow on Saurian Ops. No. Oh my god, the triple strike just killed it. Giga. Oh, what a disappointment. Haven't, it hasn't even featured in the new Jurassic World movie, but here it is dying to God knows whatever this thing is. And down it goes. Now, we just need to see if Indominus Rex is still alive and kicking because it looks like we're going to have loads of winners. But nope, Indominus Rex, that 93% has just killed the Apatosaur, which is uh, daylighting as an early Dominus. We've got the Allosaur, another favorite still surviving. 
uh, this guy, we're really whittling it down. We were we started at 118, now on 24. Some ceratops are still roaming about. The stegoceratops, one of the better herbivores. We've got um, a Diablo ceratops. We've got a Cosmo ceratops. Now I don't know. He, they that hasn't killed any. Pretty sure uh, Stegoceratops has killed something. It has killed something there. I don't know about Diablo. Diablo hasn't either. Maybe they just got lucky. Oh, here we go. Concavenator is still has not healed. Oh, it has poison. Or is it, was that thing already poisoned? It might have already been poisoned. Concavenator taking that down. Maybe it does have poison. We got the Nazuto Ceratops, which is like the Deodon Entledon thing. <laughs> Just wading through the water. Oh, this thing is making its way over. It's coming over to the big boy arena. We got Alasaur taking on one of the uh, Ceratopsians and is actually having a bit of a problem. 48 versus 45 Cosmo Ceratops. Cosmo Ceratops. Can you do it? Can he do it? Oh, I'm interested. Oh, I'm intrigued. Oh. Oh, Sella or the Kala thing picking a fight with the Nozudo. And yeah, he's pretty much won that. Didn't stand a chance there. Ooh, he might eke out a victory. Oh, Cosmo Ceratops goes down. Did not make any more extra hits. That is a shame. Indominus Rex is out. That means Mosasaur, Megalodon, and all of the other giant herbivores have survived. And this guy, that's the second time that D Driviparosaurus has won. Uh, we got to fight uh, Polacanthus dying there. Uh, what else we got over here? Oh, that is the Polacanthus. Yeah, Polacanthus is dead. So Garfield wins! <laughs> the mammoth! No, the mammoth didn't make it. <laughs> now that is a mammoth cube. <laughs> so that means that you also won as well. And who else won over here? Oh, Ankylodocus won. Dreadnought won. Uh, the Mosasaur, the Mementosaurus, the Megalodon. And we have a Sinoceratops. Why, why is a Sinoceratops over here? <laughs> That's interesting. I, this this Kali or the Sella, what's it called? Coralosaur. Wow, that was an easy name to pronounce. Why was I getting it all wrong? <laughs> the Coralosaur has been picking fights with dinosaurs um, that are pretty easy to kill. So I don't, like this has been the big boy arena over here. The Mosasaur poisoned by the Excavoraptor. Is it Ex Exo? Maybe that is the Excover Raptor. Concaven, it might be one of the only dinosaurs that can actually poison outside of the um, Coralosaurus. So it'll be interesting to see how this goes. Oh, ISR, the Inspinodoraptor, the one from Jurassic World Live, is still, is actually now on 100%. So that'll be interesting. We now only have 19 dinosaurs. And remember, eight of them, I'm pretty sure, if not more, can't actually participate in any fights. So we're really going to be seeing the finals here. It all depends on who fights who um, and who decides to re-fight who because there used to be a case of when two dinosaurs would fight, they'd go apart and they would 100% guarantee to fight again to finish it off. However, we don't see that now. Um, we see dinosaurs picking fights with other things after a fight with something else. So it could go either way. However, it looks to be a fight between the two big boys, the Coralosaurus and the Inspinodoraptor. Oh, maybe not. Nope. It looked like it was going to be, but maybe this thing, the, the Procatherium or whatever it is, uh, got in the way and it looks like it did. <laughs> Nozudoceratops still, oh, sorry, Stegoceratops still surviving over there. And now we play the waiting. Oh, the waiting. No, it. Oh, yep. No, these guys are fighting. Oh, and the Coralosaurus was actually bitten. No way. And this big plumper is still in the way. Okay, and that's it. Poisoned. Oh, that's not good. In Spider Raptor needs to finish this fight. He's not going to win. He needs to kill it. Oh, what? Why are you in the way? Oh, my God. Right. So. In Spinoraptor's dead, no matter what here. But it needs to kill Coralosaurus. It's got three bites in. Oh, he killed it! Oh, what an end! What an end! This frees up the finale to be between something different. Coralosaurus taken down. Even though it dies, it's not actually going to die. Be well, sorry, even though it dies, it does get the kill from In Spinoraptor. 63% might have a chance to uh, take on something else. Oh, we got three, two fights breaking out. Oh, oh no, it's, it's this guy. This guy has the poison. Oh, 
Oh, and he's killed Concave with it. Oh, he did so well. I was kind of hoping he'd win. But no, Excavo Raptor sniffing out and killing the uh, concavenate and only concavenate only oh they're both poisoned oh they both had poison oh dear they're both dead well that's interesting there was something else that started a fight and i don't know where that was um what do we have what do we have that's going to be left is, is it just going to be a complete win oh the sea scorpion Sea Scorpion on the Soaring Ops. The Soaring Ops is still alive. Um, Diablo Ceratops, I think, has just died now to the Soaring Ops. Yep, didn't even take a single hit. Oh, 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 I don't know, guys. I don't know. We got 100% Allosaur or 94% Allosaur. Megalodon doing his best to just be a floating Megalodon boy. Eh? Garfield enjoying the new trees. You enjoying the usual? 16 left. 16 left. Okay, out of 16, how many can fight? Right, one, two, three, four, five. Five can't fight, so already there's 11. Uh, six, seven, eight. Oh, so there's only eight. Only eight can fight, I think. Half of the half of the dinosaurs in here can't even do anything. But we still have things like the Cynoceratops and the Sea Scorpion that can be killed. Oh, Soaring Ops trying to get the easy victory against the Sino. Um, ooh, I think out of all the herbivores, yeah, he definitely got it. All the herbivores, it's up to this guy who seems to only want to sleep. Uh, <laughs> the Nizuto, Nizuto Stegoceratops thing. Because um, I think that is a new model uh, that somebody made, making it more like the concept art that Stegoceratops was going to be in the movie. A fun fact, I think the person who designed or was designing the dinosaurs um, the reason why there was no Stegoceratops in the movie, uh, even though I think it was in the script in Jurassic World, um, uh, their kid said, oh, if there's more, if there's more, uh, oh no, that was it. The ki his kid was watching Star Wars and said when Leo turned out to be a Jedi, it made Luke less special. So therefore, Indominus was the only one that was in the movie because it was special. <laughs> Otherwise, we could have had Stegoceratops in Jurassic World. And that's why the toy line, uh, you know, it exists in the Met Mattel. Yes, was it Mattel? No, Hasbro. That was it, Hasbro toy line. That's why we have a Stegoceratops because those toys get locked out. Oh, locked in, I should say. Oh, the poison. Oh, actually getting a bite off against the Allosaurus. No way. Oh, oh, oh. I think it's going to be between Allosaurus and that uh, Sauriniops or whatever it's called. I think he's just died now. Yep, down that one goes. And Allosaur takes the victory. Oh, beautiful. Allosaur was a favorite in the first few ballerinas we did and it kept on winning. Uh, which is really strange. But we've had a long drought. A long drought of Allosaurs actually finishing in the top. Same with Carnotaurus. Although I don't think Carnotaurus ever really gets into the top. Which is a bit of a shame. Uh, I'd love a mod that um, allowed for us just to basically... Like, oh, we're barely drinking. Oh, there we go. You got some. Um, to max out all the genetic modifications for all the di all the di <laughs> all the dinosaurs, so therefore it would be a complete random. Um, I'd love if someone, if anyone who uh, makes mods is watching. Uh, oh, oh god, <laughs> it's got a broken back there. Something over here dying. Oh, bless it. Well, you kind of won. You won the mini cup. Yes, you did, Kong Excavoraptor. You won. I think I did this last time where I am. I think I just healed it, and you know what? I think I'm just gonna heal it because. There's nothing it can do. Uh, can I just put flares anywhere? Flare there! Yes! <laughs> do, do flares attract dinosaurs? I can't remember. They either, they either attract them or scare them away. Now, however, it's really up to these guys, the Soaring Ops and the Allosaur. If they both decide to attack each other and finish it, then we're going to end up with like 14 or 15 runners or like final finalists because... Oh, no. No, no. If they do kill each other, then we still have Stegoceratops that can fight back. But out of everything that's in this game, uh, I think that's pretty much it. We should have the the para thing. There it is. This thing. The uh, sea scorpion. So I don't know how many kills. It's made one kill. It made one kill. I think it was like T-Rex a killed or something. <laughs> something ridiculous. Oh, they're deciding. They're deciding to sell this. Here we go. 
Allosaur looks a little bit smaller than, than this thing. Um, this is a custom dinosaur. Oh, Allosaur gets the first hit off. Oh, that's impressive. I think Saurian Ops actually had 100%. Okay. What is going on here? Allosaur gets two bites off and gets the, uh, the prior. Oh, God. Oh, God. Megalodon, you're in the way. <laughs> oh, finally a bite comes back from Saurian Ops. I was wondering... Oh, two bites. Oh, oh, okay. Now, does it have poison? I don't think it has poison. Oh, three bites! What a comeback! And he's killed it! No way! That's so strange! I actually killed Allosaurus after getting hit twice to start with. No turning around with that fight. Just straight away, bite, 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 bite. And then killed it. I did not expect that. I thought you were going to lose 60%. What was, what was the attack? 227 against 80 and 82 against 188 against 145. So it actually has way more defense uh, than Allosaur. But yeah. Yeah, that's like... What, like 80? Or 60? That's like 60 extra, but 40 difference. So it's got 40 less attack, but 60 extra defense. And of course, we all know that it doesn't matter what attack and defense difference you have just it matters whatever the, the average is if they're both added together and yours is better than the other dinosaurs then that's what determines the victor so i don't know man with two oh, with this this averaging well what are we talking here what is it 200 300 330 33 333 total I don't know if anything could take that on. I really... I would be surprised if Stegosaurus has a total stat of 300 not. Well, let's have a look. What does Stegosaurus have? Stego, you have 236. You're, you're like 100 off. So basically, we can quite clearly say that we have a winner. It is Sauriniops. Oh, no. Oh, wait, no. I was going to say, uh, unless, unless the Sea Scorpion can actually take it on. See, Scorpion, what do you have? <laughs> oh, that's not even 200. What? I'm curious. What did Megalodon have? Whoa! Megalodon actually has really good attack and defense, <laughs> but it can't use it. Oh, that's such a shame. Somebody make a, a, a Megalodon that can actually attack. That would be awesome. What about Moza? What did Moza have? Okay, Moza has nothing. <laughs> 57. But do you you don't have any kills, right? Yeah. Our uh, victors are Garfield, the what's it called? The Bre Breviparophosaurus. Breviparophosaurus. The Camarasaurus, which is daylighting as a Indracotherium. Um, we have the the Ankylodocus, Dragnautus, Mosasaurus, Megalodon, Mementosaurus, uh, an actual proper victor, because, it, well, it would have died, the Excavaraptor, and last but not least, is wow. Sauriniops, which basically is the, the biggest winner, um, and is now trying to take on the tiny little sea scorpion, and is definitely going to win, because sea scorpion does not stand a chance, with a total of 2,473 battle infamy which would only go up with the deaths of this thing because it's pretty much brought it straight to 45 <laughs> look at that bless it it's giving it a chance it's like you know what i'll turn around for you i'll turn around i'll let you have a little go <laughs> look at the little worm <laughs> no oh is it just gonna flop over or is it, i oh it's got a death animation no not the worm no and there you go. I don't know what that adds to you. Because you it actually had the T-Rex kill for it. So 2,400 gets turned into 2,600. Wow, what was your battle in for me? Oh, no, you don't have any now. And there you go. So I wouldn't be surprised if it gets to about maybe 3,000 battle in for me. Because now all, all it needs to do is kill that Stegoceratops. And there you have it, guys. What was once a vastly populated battle arena now dwindles down to 12 and if like i said stegosaurus would die it would put it down to 11 but 11 total winners is the biggest amount of winners we've ever had normally indominus rex just goes on a killing spree and kills all the other dinosaurs but for whatever reason 
it got locked in combat and that didn't happen. But if you enjoyed this video, guys, and you want to see more, whenever more mods are released, uh, we'll definitely do this. I'm going to need a, we're going to need a new way to do this. I think I'm just going to release the uh, herbivores as they come. I think that's the best way to do it. But if you enjoyed this video, guys, leave a like. Until next time, I'll see you later. Oh, bye-bye.